the first frontier that I managed to make in the dosol chart. This is where the ghosts are. And so far I have uh, met one of my rivals. This is Dariel. And I'm recording because he just declared me a war. It is turn 45. And I have uh, a small border with him. Not uh, very good cards. So with uh, my main hero, I should be able to get a few of these provinces and expand my borders to the north. Apparently, where Dariel is. Let's see what else did I got. I get actually because uh, as far as I remember when we have did the verb is in infinitive. Right? <laughs> Maybe not. But I'm learning. I like to learn. So Right here, near the, the water, I managed to get a free settlement, went through the halflings. Now, these halflings, if I'm not fast enough, Dariel will get them. I found another halflings here, that I have their quest to defeat 15 robbers, and I get one thug from the mercenary camp. He's carrying most of my bat battles so far. I'm very close to get uh, my second uh, level unit, but with that war at hand, maybe it will wait. Now let's see to the top and right. Uh, this is some nomad tribes that I managed to bribe for around 500. I don't know how I spared this from my heart. <laughs> now, the rest of the provinces around, here we have Savage Wood, Princess Lands, Empty Hills, that should be Griffins, those Halflings, Giants that I cannot still fight, this Princess Land maybe I can get when I, I make the boundary to the, no to the north. So for now, I will go back and take a few units. I'm almost level 10, which will allow me to make the double shot. Alright, first turn, he didn't attack. Oh, he's approaching from the bottom. So this is where, well, I will spend some of my adventurers. Guard this for now. And I will attack the Dorat. Ah, this war is ruining my plans. <laughs> okay, still don't have enough gold for second uh, level unit. Not with this. Alright, all will be spare men then. Okay, still this these things. I think I made everything. Can I? Okay. Oh, I can make the stable. Uh, 150 gold. But it brings now plus five. Okay. Okay. I will save the rest of the gold. And let's see what may happen. Thief, a ah, brigand. Well, if there is a brigand, I should fight this because I have a quest to make. Ah, wait, did I let them? Okay, this is his mage. Let's see what his mage can do. His level 3 mage, having undead summoning power. So I will need to defeat him first. We'll accept. Uh, he heal himself. Uh, the next two should be archers. Huh? Fire at will. 
Oh, I took his stuff. All right, now I'm level 10. <laughs> we got leave this. Uh, okay, on this event, I usually take the deal because uh, the other two options <laughs> will anger the province. And after that, I can remove them. This is just 50 gold spent. Okay, so what we... Oh, another dragon. I needed these provinces because of the dragons. Also, there are two temples that I haven't visited yet. I'm practicing my memory with this, so I haven't visited two temples. Temple of Light, and I haven't visited the Archery Store yet. Well, since I spent the, the gold for my second level ranged weapon, for now it should be fine. Now let's see. This this is the weakest point, but it is good. It should be good to take away his horses. Well, I will need the contract now. Or not yet. Now let's make this one. And I will continue to attack him. Helic. Uh, the took. The thug, thug. He needs some healing. Uh, how much crystal do I have? I have enough. What is my second hero doing? Ah, the interesting thing about this one is that I found the Chris. This gives me soul stealing. <laughs> Very funny. With counter attack one. But yet, for these uh, low level units around the town, around my stronghold, it is pretty okay. So, did I make everything? No. Okay. It gives me more gold, so I will take it. So, these are next. Seven. I will let them leave because I will need all of my units now to fight his main hero. Ah, very cool place for my archer on the hill and he is guarded by a lake. How awesome is that? Ah. Okay. Now, I think to avoid Is that armor for ah, nothing? I think to avoid destroying units because he will have uh, some rise undead spell. That's why I will take the hero first if I can. <laughs> Almost got him. Right, it's time to make some move. Oh, air shield. You. Okay, now let's eliminate. Ah, oh, oh, oh. Not this way. All right. That's bad. Oh. <gasps> okay, look. He has alliance with the half link. Uh, this is why he was able to take the second half link. Is something that was just in my head. That thing is strong. How dare they? Ah, I will need these units. Don't kill them. <laughs> Disgusting creatures. 
right. Mm -hmm. Always health is good. Took two. Ah, I don't have enough gold to make this. Ah, oh, he has redwood. Oh, I want that. Ooh, kitty, kitty. And how he got so many provinces? Turn 48. Okay, well, uh, my plan here is to reach his uh, stronghold and place. Well, I have uh, how many? I have uh, one adventurer with. Uh, now I will have more. Oh, I also have the Heavenly Guards, uh, but they cost a lot of gems, so maybe I'll not use them. Until I'm here at the bottom, my right flank is not developed well, so when I find the other two rivals, it should be somewhere on this line. Wow, this is a lot. This is a lot of unexplored map. Uff. Okay, what do we have here? Slingers. I can tell. Oh, he used his guards right here in the wild field. This is cool. I will not bother with this province. So when I take the redwood. I can remove these ones. I will leave the, the lizards just in case if I'm not able to make the alliance with the halflings. And this is a lot of thinking. And so, that should be it. And I think this is a decent front line. Anyway, when I deal with the green, I will continue to develop the right flank. And the next video I will record where the explored map is. So we have a glance, a view of this chart in my historical records. And thanks for watching.